Terry holds 12 cards, each of which is red, white, green, or blue. If a person is to select a card randomly from the cards Terry is holding, it's the probability less than one half that the card selected will be either red or white. So, we want to know whether the probability of red or white is less than one half. Now notice the probability of red or white. First of all, this is going to equal the probability of red plus the probability of white because these are disjoint conditions, they're non-overlapping conditions. Notice also that the probability of picking red or white is one minus the complement space, one minus the probability of picking green or blue. And so that would be one minus probability of green minus probability of blue. So if we know either green and blue, or we know red and white, we'd be able to answer the question. Well, statement number one tells us probability that a person will select blue is one third. Probability of blue is one third. By itself, that statement is not sufficient to answer the question. So this is insufficient. Statement number two tells us the probability that a person will select red is one sixth. Probability of red equals one six. Just knowing that and nothing else is insufficient, we cannot answer the question. Now if we combine the statements, well now we know probability of red, but we don't know the probability of white, so we can't figure it out that way. We know the probability of blue, but we don't know the probability of green, so we can't figure it out that way. So even now, all attempts to find a numerical answer are stymied. We do not have enough evidence. So even combined, the statements are insufficient, and the answer is E.